Welcome to our YouTube video. Today, we delve into the intriguing life and voyages of Christopher Columbus, the renowned explorer who forever changed the course of history. Join us as we explore his early life, his daring voyages across the Atlantic, and the lasting impact of his discoveries. Discover the triumphs and controversies surrounding Columbus, and gain a deeper understanding of the complex legacy he left behind. Let's dive into the captivating world of Christopher Columbus. Christopher Columbus, born in 1451 in Genoa, Italy, was an explorer and navigator who is widely credited with opening up the Americas to European exploration. He embarked on several voyages across the Atlantic Ocean in the late 15th century, funded by the Spanish monarchy, in search of a western sea route to Asia. Columbus played a significant role in the Age of Discovery and is often considered one of the most important figures in world history. Early Life and Background Christopher Columbus was born into a middle-class family in Genoa, a port city in Italy. His father, Domenico Colombo, was a weaver and later became a tavern owner. Columbus had three brothers and one sister. As a child, Columbus received a basic education and learned navigation and maritime skills by working on his father's ships and later as an apprentice to a merchant in Genoa. These experiences sparked his interest in exploration and the sea. Columbus was exposed to various influences and ideas prevalent during the Renaissance, a period of cultural and intellectual flourishing in Europe. It was a time when scholars and thinkers began challenging traditional beliefs and sought new knowledge and understanding of the world. Voyages of Christopher Columbus First Voyage, 1492 Seeking a new trade route to Asia, Columbus proposed his plan to several European monarchs, including Queen Isabella and King Ferdinand of Spain. After several rejections, they finally agreed to sponsor his expedition. On August 3, 1492, Columbus set sail with three ships, Santa Maria, Pinta, and Nina, from Palos de la Frontera, Spain. He and his crew of about 90 men embarked on a westward journey across the Atlantic. After a long and arduous voyage, on October 12, 1492, Columbus and his crew made landfall in the present-day Bahamas, believing they had reached the East Indies. He explored various islands in the Caribbean, including Cuba and Hispaniola, and encountered the indigenous Tino people. Columbus returned to Spain in 1493, bringing back news of his discoveries. Second Voyage, 1493 to 1496. Columbus embarked on a second voyage in 1493 with a larger fleet of 17 ships and approximately 1,500 men. This time, he aimed to establish permanent settlements and further explore the newly discovered lands. He explored more islands in the Caribbean, including Puerto Rico and Jamaica, and established a colony called La Isabella on the northern coast of Hispaniola, present-day Dominican Republic. The second voyage was marked by conflicts with the indigenous people and harsh conditions, leading to discontent among the colonists and strained relations with the Spanish crown. Third voyage, 1498 to 1500. Columbus set sail on his third voyage in 1498, this time with six ships. His primary objective was to find a passage to Asia, but he explored the coast of South America, including present-day Venezuela. During this voyage, Columbus faced numerous challenges, including shipwrecks and mutinies. He was eventually arrested and sent back to Spain in chains in 1500. Fourth Voyage, 1502-1504 Columbus undertook his final voyage in 1502, again in search of a western route to Asia. He explored Central America, including the coasts of Honduras, Nicaragua, and Panama. The voyage was fraught with hardships, including storms, disease, and shipwrecks. Columbus was forced to abandon two of his four ships and return to Spain in 1504. Legacy and Controversies Columbus's Voyages and the Columbian Exchange Columbus's voyages had a profound impact on world history. Initiating the Columbian Exchange, the widespread exchange of plants, animals, diseases, and cultures between the Old World, Europe, and the New World, the Americas. The Columbian Exchange had both positive and negative consequences, such as the introduction of new crops and livestock to Europe, 
but also the transmission of diseases to the indigenous populations, leading to devastating epidemics. Historical Significance and Criticism Columbus is often celebrated for opening up the Americas to European exploration, which eventually led to the colonization and establishment of European colonies in the New World. However, Columbus's actions and their consequences have been subject to criticism. He and his men subjected the indigenous people to violence, forced labor, and disease, resulting in the decimation of their populations. Additionally, Columbus's role in the transatlantic slave trade, although indirect, contributed to the enslavement and exploitation of African people in the Americas. Columbus Day and Changing Perceptions Columbus's legacy has been a topic of debate, and the observance of Columbus Day on October 12 in the United States has been controversial. Some argue that it celebrates a figure associated with colonization, exploitation, and the mistreatment of indigenous peoples. In recent years, there has been a growing movement to replace or reframe Columbus Day with Indigenous Peoples Day, honoring the cultures and contributions of Native Americans while acknowledging the complex history surrounding Columbus. Christopher Columbus, through his voyages, inadvertently transformed the world by connecting Europe and the Americas, initiating an era of exploration, colonization, and exchange that would have far-reaching effects on the course of history. However, his actions and their consequences have sparked ongoing discussions about the impact of European colonization on indigenous peoples and the need for a more nuanced understanding of historical figures and events. Thank you for watching our video on Christopher Columbus. We hope you found it informative and engaging. If you enjoyed the content and want to stay updated with our future videos, please consider subscribing to our channel. By subscribing, you'll be part of our community, and you won't miss out on any exciting historical explorations. Once again, thank you for your support, and we look forward to bringing you more captivating content in the future. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and join us on this amazing journey of discovery.